Greetings, today is Saturday, June 29, 2024. This is meteorologist Ruben Garcia. At the time of recording this video, it is 6 a.m. in the region of the Lesser Antilles, where preparation should be underway for the impact of the dangerous hurricane barrel, which will be approaching the region during the hours of Monday, especially for the islands of Martinique, Dominica, St. Vincent, and the Grenadines, and Barbados. Let's now look at the projected wind gusts according to the GFS model. Wind gusts of over 120 or 130 km per hour could affect Barbados on Monday morning associated with Hurricane Barrel. Wind gusts of up to 180 or 190 km per hour could affect St. Vincent and the Grenadines, and hurricane force winds could also affect St. Lucia. Further north, between Guadeloupe and Dominica, tropical storm force winds of 40 to 70 km per hour could be reported on Monday morning under this projection. Hurricane Barrel should maintain a trajectory south of Puerto Rico, so tropical storm winds are not expected to affect the island. Similarly, Tropical storm winds are not anticipated to affect the Dominican Republic. In the final part of this animation, we can also potentially see Tropical Storm Chris or Hurricane Chris moving through the same region of the Lesser Antilles, possibly as a Category 1 or 2 hurricane between Wednesday and Thursday next week. It is important for residents of the Lesser Antilles to prepare for the impact of two cyclones, the first being Hurricane Barrel, which could arrive as a major hurricane this Monday followed by another tropical cyclone or potentially Hurricane Chris by Thursday and Friday. It will be a challenging situation for our followers in the islands south of the Lesser Antilles. Finally, let's look at the accumulated rainfall projection from the GFS model. It is projecting 350 to 200 millimeters of accumulated rainfall, especially between Monday and Wednesday. Significant flooding could occur across Barbados, Dominica, St. Vincent, and the Grenadines, with some rainfall in Trinidad and Tobago between 75 to 100 millimeters. The outer bands of future hurricane barrel could leave rainfall accumulations of 50 to 75 millimeters from Guadeloupe to Dominica, with some rainfall expected for eastern Puerto Rico and the Dominican Republic, with accumulations of 2 to 3 inches for Puerto Rico, and between 50 to 70 millimeters for eastern Dominican Republic. That's all for this update. I will update the forecast again this afternoon to discuss any changes in the coming hours. For now, goodbye, and have an excellent day.